hey there in this video we are going to discuss very important plugin cookie notice and compliance for gdpr ccpa in wordpress so as you can see this is a very useful and very uh, necessary plugin nowadays when you create a website and uh, you are using any user data or if you want to use any data and uh, you need to use this plugin to make sure that your users have good experience okay so this cookie notice and compliance for gdpr ccpa plugin is one of the uh, simple custom customizable and uh, very useful plugin which is uh, used to uh, take the consent from the user okay so now you can see here it is used to help your website comply with certain cookie consent requirements under the EU GDPR cookie law and CCPA regulations and includes seamless integration with cookie compliance to help your site comply with the latest updates to existing consent laws. Okay, so this is very crucial and if you are having a WordPress website, then I suggest you must use this plugin. Okay so let's see how this works so this is uh, a fully featured consent management platform and it provides automated compliance features okay so uh, it is basically compliance cookie compliance enables website to take a proactive approach to data protection and consent laws okay so let's see what this plugin do so this plugin provides simple and customizable website banner also um, consent on click scroll or close multiple cookie expire options link to privacy policy page uh, wordpress privacy page synchronization it is also uh, seo friendly and multilingual as well okay so you can use for international consent uh, consent duration selector cookie purpose categories and so many features available right so this plugin you uh, covers this current and upcoming regulations so gdpr that is for europe region e privacy directive e privacy regulation pcr that is for uk brazil this pdb pdpb that is for india and for us as well okay this is cpra is for us california so different countries have different laws regarding uh, the uh, user consent and uh, this plugin covers almost all basic and uh, important country laws consent regulations okay so let's see how this plugin works and how you can integrate in wordpress so i have installed this plugin here in wordpress you can see let's activate this once you activate you will uh, get the option here says cookies okay here you can uh, dismiss this notice that is not related to our plugin let's go to settings it will redirect to this cookies page yeah so here this is configuration page settings page for our plugin okay so here uh, compliance settings compliance status so right now notice is activated by default activated auto blocking cookies categories and proof of consent are inactive so these are additional features available with this plugin but we are going to discuss this notice only okay so if you want to add this compliance feature click here add compliance feature and uh, it will check the uh, let's say compatibility okay and it will show you if it is com compatible or not so right now i am having website on localhost so this auto blocking cookie categories and proof of consent these three features are not compatible with this localhost wordpress installation okay so let's go to back and we are not uh, using this uh, in our video so let's go to other features so app id app key if you are uh, using this cookie compliance 
so uh, you can register on this website cookiecompliance.co uh, and uh, yeah cookiecompliance.co right and uh, you can also create your application and uh, apply application id and application key here so you can uh, create or you can create dashboard there you can have data in detail whatever users are doing on your website okay so this is optional you can avoid it the main option is notice settings so this is message this is the message when user is going to see this uh, cookie compliance uh, tab you will see this message this is totally customizable you can add your own message as well okay this is button text okay privacy policy we will see this later on okay so let me quickly save the changes and let me open our blog so let me open this on our incognito mode and yep you can see this is cookie notice right so this is the text which we have seen here we use cookies to ensure that uh, we give you the best ex experience on our website if you continue to use this site we will assume that you are happy with it okay so right now you can click on ok and this bar will go away all right so let's go and make some changes in this configuration first is uh, you can change this ok button text let's make it yeah or anything you want privacy policy so here you can give the link to your privacy policy page you might need to create one page here in wordpress so let me uh, give another let's give simple sample page as privacy policy page for example you can create your own privacy policy page and link here okay when you uh, click here on uh, this privacy policy link it will uh, open in a new tab okay and uh, this with the link banner or you can also keep as a message refuse consent so if you want to give user the possibility to refuse this third party non functional cookies so you can give option to no as well okay revoke consent so if you enable this option this will enable to give the user the possibility to revoke their consent okay so let's see how this works so script blocking you can also add uh, your uh, google analytics code here okay that is non functional cookies so you can add this javascript code here and uh, there are other options like reloading this this option will reload the page after you accept the notice or user will accept the notice then that page will reload you can also make this notice available when user scroll the page okay let's enable this and it will give you some numbers 100 pixel so uh, this number uh, pixel user have to scroll okay then this will appear on click so this option will uh, enable to accept the notice on any click on the, so you can click anywhere on the page and it will accept the cookies but we are not using that also you can set the expiry here so the amount of time that cookie should be stored for when the user accept the notice so after certain time let's say i am making it one week then after one week user will see this notice again because accepted expiry is one week rejected expiry is again one week or whatever you want to set you can change it here so uh, once user reject the cookies after 3 months for example this notice will appear again conditional display so here you can add some rules i am not going uh, in much details but, but you can have a look okay you can add rule here that if page type is uh, equal to some page for example then it will hide okay so it will hide this notice De deactivation so if you want to uh, delete all the data for this plugin 
on deactivation of this plugin also the script placement so if you make it header it will be in head tag and if we uh, select the footer it will be at the end of the body so you can make it uh, as per a requirement here you can change the position let's make it top animation let's make it slide text color this opacity the bar color button color it depends on your theme what color you want okay and you can add additional class here and uh, apply css as per your need so let me save and once it is saved refresh then you see now this is on top right you can see we have this position selected as top let's make it bottom so now we have this on bottom right so as we selected these options like uh, I kept it yeah let's make it okay and uh, no is fine and save okay so it should be okay no and privacy policy page so once you click here it will open a new tab with this privacy policy page so right now I have linked the sample page not privacy page it's a sample page okay so similarly you can create your own privacy policy page it may be on um, other page and you just need to link here let's see how you can link here it should be here okay so these are the options available here on scroll unable to accept the notice when user scrolls so right now when i scroll to 100 pixel it automatically accepted okay so let me disable I don't recommend that option but you can apply that option if you want okay so let's see right now you will not see it because uh, once I scrolled 100 pixel it automatically got accepted okay so if you want to see again you might need to close the browser and open again because it's uh, incognito you will see this notice again okay once I click OK it is accepted now okay so these are the options you can uh, use to uh, add this cookie notice on your wordpress website also you see this consent logs so right now i am using free plugin version so you cannot see these consent logs but if you are planning to upgrade your plugin you can see which users have uh, accepted or rejected cookie consent and uh, based on that you can change the uh, cookie text or uh, whatever you want with this consent content okay so in my opinion if you are using wordpress and uh, if you are planning for cookie compliance implementation this plugin is best you can see here this is uh, well updated active installations are 1 million plus so this is good and you see these five star reviews are very good right so overall ratings are very nice and you can use it without any issue okay you can also uh, go and upgrade this plugin as well if you want but it depends on your requirement all right so that's all for this video guys if this video is helpful to you please like this video and subscribe to my channel I have created more videos on WordPress as well. So you can visit my channel and have a look. Okay.